Hi, my name is Carlene Ding. I am a current senior at MSMS, and I'm also a student athlete. I play for the MSMS Blue Waves, our soccer team. For all my prospective MSMS students out there who might be interested in playing soccer, or really any sport for that matter, you don't have to have loads of experience um, to play that sport. Just some background information about me. This is roughly my eighth or ninth year playing soccer, but you don't have to have all that experience. In fact, like our soccer team is comprised of mostly beginner players, some people who have never played before, some people who this is like their first few years of playing soccer. So um, really any sport here at MSMS, if you feel interested in playing, I highly encourage you to do so. It can be really fun and it can really help, you know, balance your academics and you know keep you going throughout the day and you know just at least give it a try but that being said here is my week as a student athlete on campus okay good morning so it's currently like 8 30 ish right now and my first class starts at 9 a.m it's my independent study for math outreach but i kind of want to go to the library to have it because I hate being stuck in my room all the time, so yeah, but before that, I'm gonna see if I can get a quick stop at the cafeteria. Oh, and I also have to get my temperature checked at Go In Front Office because COVID is still around. Hopefully, I can have four nine o'clock. I'll probably just stop and get a muffin or something at the cafeteria, but we'll see. Let's go! I've got my band on for Tuesday. I'm uh, ready to go. Oh God, dining center. Um, I didn't have time to get like a plate of food. So instead, I got a muffin, a blueberry muffin, muffin check. <laughs> right now it's like 8.50ish, so I'm racing to the library. It's like right there, so it's all good. I think I'm gonna make it. I'll see you inside. Okay, so I made it to the library. It's 8.57. I got here a few minutes ago, so I'm all good. There a few people are over there. Some of my classmates like right over there. I'm not about to join my Zoom meeting. So I just got out of my uh, math outreach class. It was my independent study. Next, I have my next class, mechanics. The physics class is in five minutes. It should be pretty chill. Oh, I realize I'm in a public space, the library, and so I can't take off my mask. And so I can't eat my muffin, my blueberry muffin. I can't eat it. Um, so it's actually been quite a bit since I last updated you, uh, but it's around 110, 15, 115 ish. Uh, I forgot to mention that today is actually uh, an away game. We have an away game today against St. Andrews. Woo, game day! But anyways, this game is a pretty big deal. It can help determine whether they go to playoffs or not. And St. Andrews is a really, really good team. So we might get smoked. I don't know. <laughs> we'll see. But anyways, I, I wanted to show you how I get ready, what I bring on away games, especially long ones like this. So let's get to it. Wow! Okay, so I got my white jersey here because of the away game. We wear white. Um, on top, so it's my white jersey. Number 22, these are my shorts, um, my socks. These are sweats to wear on the sidelines in the bus. And then I got some things to wear underneath, like a long sleeve shirt and leggings, if I need it, who knows. And then I got my contacts because I can't see without them. And I need, <laughs> I need them. And everything will go in this bag right here with my cleats and my shin guards are in there as well. We also have to bring this, this here. It's um, just a foldable chair because we have to main socially distance on the sidelines. And so we don't use the benches. We have to bring these foldable chairs. So we're about to load the bus. <laughs> I'm vlogging for the wave. See our road, you want to say hi? It's for the wave. It's for the oh, wave. I'm sorry. Oh. <laughs> it was for the wave. And we're on the bus. You want to say hi, Lainey? <laughs> it's for the wave. <laughs> Okay, so <laughs> I forgot to vlog, but we just finished our match and we lost 7-0 against St. Andrews. Kind of expected, but we played really, really well. And um, that's all that matters. The boys team are about to play. They're like right over there. Um, so yeah, we're about to pack up the bus and leave. Taylor, do you want to say hi to the wave? Hi! <laughs> um, but yeah, we're, we're, we're packing up and we're about to leave. That was a good game. Okay, <laughs> good morning. 
so it's the next day clearly all right now i'm headed to breakfast <laughs> today's actually a pretty hectic day i got a meeting at nine for a business plan and then one at 1 p.m um i don't think i have mechanics class today um it's fun and work wasn't feeling too well so we don't have class today but i do have calculus and i do have to study today for my calculus test which is on thursday that i have to make up today's pretty hectic day i guess the other things in between those times but yeah I'll try to get to breakfast soon because it's like around 8.40 <laughs> and my meeting's at 9, so... Okay, so I got my breakfast, yay! It's actually like a decent amount of food instead of just a muffin like last time. I'm now back at the dorms, like I'm about to go in, uh, but I have a, like I said earlier, a 9 a.m. meeting and a 1 p.m. meeting. So I just got done with my mentor meeting for our business plan with Mr. Robertson. He was so sweet, so kind. Um, I'm feeling really good about this plan. He, he got some really good suggestions, but uh, yeah, I'm feeling pretty stoked. I'm ready to present, kind of, not really. Looking forward to it, um, but right now I'm going to finish up the breakfast that I never really got to eat yet. Here's, here's the loot, here's the loot. <laughs> I had to go buy my omelet, but I got an omelet, potatoes, and cheese grits. Um, it's kind of a lot of food, but I'm super hungry, and it's now cold, so I'm going to finish that as soon as possible. Uh, after I finish this, I'm going to probably do some mechanics work. I really need to catch up on the test. I need to finish that test, and then calculus, probably get a head start on the study guide that I did not get to yet. So this is my business group. Everyone say hi. This is Maniba, Fiona, and Lainey. <laughs> okay. Just a quick, quick practice, but I'm on my way to dinner now. Hopefully I can meet some people there. But anyways, what's headed for tonight is I gotta study for my calculus test that I had to make up. I gotta finish my mechanics thing. Didn't quite finish it yet. The meetings for business plan actually went really well, in case you're wondering. And I have also have calculus homework. So, yup. We'll see how this goes tonight. It's gonna be a pretty busy night. A lot, a lot of stuff. I'm now doing homework. I just finished mechanics. My mechanics test, so that's good. I'm, I did pretty well. Uh, I also have to do Cal homework. That's due like pretty soon. Calculus homework complete. Yay! Actually, didn't take me too long, so that's actually pretty good. Hi everyone. So it's um the next day. It's around 9:30 a.m. I have mechanics second block. That's in roughly 30 minutes, and then I have calculus for fifth block. And then after that today we have another game against St. Joseph. They're they're pretty good. Um, St. Andrews St. Joseph's are pretty good teams, but hopefully this game will go a little bit better than the last one. But the thing is, if we win this game and the game on Saturday against Yazoo County, we will make it to playoffs. So that's pretty exciting. But that's, <laughs> I don't know if it's going to happen or not. I don't know. Scary stuff. But Saturday is our very, very last game. It's senior day, um, so it's a really big deal. Okay, so actually, we just got out of mechanics. It's only been like 10 minutes, so we got out really early and he just told us to get a head start. But yeah, I, I decided while um, I'm doing it, I'm going to show you what happens on the Zoom behind the scenes. Okay, so this is a little behind the scenes of what goes on for the Vision. If you don't know already, the Vision is MSMS's student news online newspaper, pretty much student led, all that good gist. Um, and so, this particular article, as you can see, it's blue waves, topples, Philadelphia tornadoes. It's about uh, the soccer game that happened last week. The girls team played against Philadelphia and we won. Teehee. So, Carter wrote this one, but my job as a photography editor is to find images that go with each article and then caption those images as well and make sure everything looks all right on the website. Luckily someone was taking pictures of this game and me and Manipa, the current editor-in-chief, we were sending pictures back and I found these pictures and we thought that uh, this image would be really good. Sorry. Um, what I did was I uploaded it to here, right here, and um, if I click preview this will show what it might look like when we publish it on the website so there will be a caption right here which me or me will write and um yeah this is pr pretty much what it looks like it's, it's really cool so if you're interested in doing the vision next year um, 
I was dressed there first of all. See, this is the staff. Here I am right here. If you want to become part of the staff next year and write articles or draw cartoons or take pictures, basically journalism stuff, if you want to do that, I think the vision is a good place to start to learn about it or to pursue further into journalism. So it's around 12:30 ish and I didn't really eat much at lunch. Um just kind of talk to people. Since I didn't eat much, I'm gonna fill my fuels <laughs> with an apple because my mom always says to eat an apple for every meal. So this is for you, mom. The only class I have left today is Cal 3 with Miss K AP Cal 3. And um also I don't know if you can tell or not, but it's been drizzling, raining, sprinkling, whatever you want to call it. <laughs> For quite a bit and that means that the game might be unfortunately cancelled which kind of sucks because this is our second to last game of the season they'll probably end up rescheduling it if it gets cancelled but I don't know I'm just really hyped to play against St. Joe's today so it's a little bit upsetting um, I'm gonna eat my apple now or it's like a fat bite and probably do some work to kill time because class doesn't start until 2.30 well as I thought <laughs> that sucks. Swap them up, doesn't matter. And I'm just gonna go with what Zach said. Hey guys, good morning. It's um Saturday, 9 a.m. I kind of just woke up. Today we have two games lined up. So Thursday, the one that got canceled because of the rain, we're gonna have today. Um, our first match is against Yazoo County. Uh, I think it starts at 11.30 for the girls, and then after our game, we have some recognitions and the boys play against Yazoo County. Then we have to come back and play again at 5 p.m. against St. Joe's, the game that got rescheduled, and the boys play later, I think, like 6.30, I can't really remember. Um, today's the, the big day. <laughs> okay, everyone say hi! hi. <laughs> Anyway, she is from Biloxi, Mississippi. She is the daughter of Cassandra and John Thompson. Her favorite soccer memory is junior year when she played games and the loser losing team had to do a TikTok dance. She is a native of Starkville, Mississippi. She's the daughter of Dwayne and Susan Dean. Her favorite soccer memory is the slide tackling on super muddy fields or witnessing Westland randomly fall down near the middle of the game. <laughs> Hi guys, so we just finished our game and we're now watching the boys play. Everyone say hi. This watching the boys. I can't do this. Fiona, Vidi, and Destiny right there. Oh my goodness. Oh, no. uh, we won 7 0 and tier. <laughs> hey y'all. Fit check. <laughs> oh girl, I feel like boo boo. And she got two cents. The only reason that we got a goal was because the other team kicked it. Hi guys, this Hi. is Breezy, Destiny. We're Carleen's juniors. Yeah. Um, we took her phone. Oh, I can't see. We're gonna try to narrate for you guys. Hey guys, this is Coach Yarby. He's our coach. He's Hi our everybody. <laughs> I'm undercover so people don't recognize me and I'm a cap on. This is what I really look like. Boom! This is Dr. McConnell. Came to watch the game. Hello, everybody. Good to see you. <laughs> hey, vlog. I dyed my hair pink. Just finished the soccer game. Uh, yeah, Claire dyed her hair black. Yeah. I did. Hi, guys. I'm Claire. I'm just doing the wave. Oh, my gosh. Okay, bye. <laughs> Hello, hi guys. Um, so this is the end of the vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed watching what it's like to be a student athlete here on campus. And so I hope you guys feel encouraged, inspired, found something new uh, about sports here at MSMS. And if you're interested in playing a sport, you should totally do it. I guess maybe I'll see you around. Bye.